Well, you know, every time some um, celebrity mm. from television or the cinema um, goes into a rehabilitation clinic, yeah. they that usually have, <laughs> which happens a lot, you normally find there is some yeah. media spokesman yeah. who comes out and says, oh, she is wrestling with her demons. Yeah. Yeah. Or he has to deal with his demons, yeah. you know? And mm -hmm. this phrase, the demons, is very yeah. real. People still use it. Well, that expression was used yes. first by mm -hmm. the fourth century yeah. Christian monks. Mm -hmm who when they went into the silence of the desert, as you were saying, yeah. they didn't find peace and tranquility. Yeah. They found inner, mm. inner turmoil. Yeah. And they, when they compared notes mm. with each other, they found that this inner turmoil had the same shape. Mm. Yeah. It was actually part of the inner life of all human beings mm. to find these demons there. Yes. Now these demons, they, they named them. They mm. named eight demons, yes. three in the body, yeah food, yeah. sex, and yeah. things, yeah. three in the heart, anger, mm -hmm. sadness, yes. and boredom, mm -hmm. especially boredom with the yeah. spiritual life. Yeah. Being yeah. bored with the spiritual life mm -hmm. is one of the mm -hmm. demons. Yeah. And then when you've conquered all six of those demons, you go, ah, now yes. I'm on the road to God. <laughs> But two more demons then come up between you, yeah. and these are the worst demons, yeah. the demon of pride, that says, oh, I have conquered all the other demons. Oh dear, I'm already there. I'm, I've made it. <laughs> yeah. And then finally, if you conquer pride, mm. then of course, you become very famous. Yeah. And the last one is called vainglory, mm -hmm. or celebrity. Now, yeah. what's interesting is in the Middle Ages, the church took these eight demons yeah. and made them into the seven mm. deadly yeah. sins. Yes. But what's really important to mm. notice is mm. that in the monastic tradition, yeah. In the monastic tradition, these are not called sins. Mm -hmm. Why is this? Because they called them actually thoughts. Yes. They said they're the eight thoughts. Mm -hmm. For some reason, the Middle Ages got rid of yeah. vainglory and pride mm -hmm. and, and put the two together. Yeah. This was a mistake because in the 21st century, we have rediscovered the eighth yeah. of them, which is vainglory, the sin yeah. of celebrity, yes. I call it. Yeah. But they called them thoughts. Mm -hmm. and the reason they called them thoughts is they said, if you are on the road to God, yeah. you will meet yes. these thoughts along the way. Yeah. So if we call them sins, yeah. it makes me feel something okay. has gone wrong yes. if I experience this. Whereas what the early ch the monks said was, if it is going right, then if it is right. going well, yeah. then you will experience yeah. these. Now that's really encouraging, mm -hmm. I think, yeah. because if we know that to meet these demons mm. shows that I'm on the road to God, yeah. Yeah. then I have the courage to face them. Yeah. If I think that meeting the demons means I'm, I'm a terrible failure, then I probably try to run away from them. Yes, of course. So I think that, that what, what yeah. a, the monastic tradition can mm. offer people is a great deal more confidence in facing the demons.